<clears throat> hey, what's up? It's your girl, Missy Vet, and I'm coming to you today. It's Saturday, uh, February 11, 2017, and this is my mukbang show for today. I have made my very own buffalo wings, which I fry with seasonings and no flour because I don't really fry my chicken in flour. Um, I got my too many ingredient salad. I'll tell you what's in it shortly. And then I got my homemade hot and spicy buffalo sauce. It's a whole little dipping sauce. It's spicy. Then I got my drink. This is my glass. It says wine and shoes. What else? Um, girl's best friend wine and shoes. I picked this up also at the dollar store somewhere. And today's drink one of my favorites, Haritos. I get this always in Southwest Detroit when I go shopping. Um, it's like a lime, it's a lime pop. It's like a little Mexican brand soda. It's so good, very good, my favorite. So today, you know, I'm not doing much. We're gonna talk about, um, well, I'm actually watching, I'm trying to catch up on some shows because I've been running around busy all week. So today I'm watching, I'm catching up with um, Too Close to Home by Tyler Perry, which I, I love this show. I love Tyler Perry. I love his shows, period. It's the best. He's the bomb. So, I guess we can begin. Cause Previously, I'm too close kids to Kids free right now. Decide, like, hey, let me do a video. You are a good man. He's nice to me. I got my salad dressing. It's your point of view to talk to a woman over at the trailer park. It's Olive Garden. Because you can actually make a thing at trailer. It's my second I just need some choice of salad dressing. Yeah, I can do that. She's my mother. I always have like a little bit of each, like a little bit of Olive Garden, and then I switch. So I don't like cover the whole salad. I just like pour a little bit over it, and then I eat a little bit of this, and I switch. And then sometimes I just might mix it so I get both flavors. But since I love Olive Garden so much, and I love the salad dressing when I go there, I don't know where I found this at the grocery store down the street. No, no, shut your lying mouth. It's in the store now. It was on sale for three dollars. So I wonder what it's gonna be tomorrow when I go. Please, please. Because I bought this bottle alone. like two no, weeks ago, maybe. You need to hear this. And I just got a coupon for a dollar off, so I wanna go get me another bottle. Okay, well, let's tell you what's going on in my salad. Ooh, wait. So I'm too close for home. You're lying. What makes you think you're important enough to be so like Rebel just found out this guy she's been hanging with such a is bitch. her father. And She's her lying. cousin's father, which You're is lying. her mother's father, because their father raped her do his daughters and made kids with them. All right, so far I got my tomato. I'll be messed up up on the mind. My mother's dad is my dad. See you, Tony. Wow. All right, Tyler Perry. You want me to be then I got my honey smoked ham. You want me to be just like you? Accusing me of sleeping around on so the floor. Thank you very much. You're the horse in the line. It's about these trailer you park people living in a trailer home. You be to her. One chick messing around. What did he say? Name? Anna, Annie, Annabelle. What the hell did he say, Rebel? Well, she she had a baby her. with her dad. I asked left. You a question. Went to go work for the president. That's how it all started out in season one. We're in season two right now. Are you lying? And are you put in jail? Slept with the president. You were jealous of him and his money. She got three sisters who are raped by their dad. And two of them got kids by their dad. And their mom's this big old heavy girl lady. Yeah. She can't even get out I the bed. Am. And I'm smarter than all three of you. I didn't lie on some man and I didn't get pregnant at 12 and 13 like all three of you did. I did it. I'm better than you. I'm better than this. Let's rebel. She's, a, um, she's like 15, you 16. Being pregnant? I'm not. I'm sorry. Yeah. No, no, I'm sorry. not. I'm not the yeah. three of you. Black okay? Olive. Okay, I'm not. I like green olives, but my salad, I prefer black olives. I got my cucumbers. Oh, these are baby cucumbers. They're about, I think I'm like about this big. 
The lack of a full of fiber. It's the truth. No, it's not. He said you would see that. Without a snap to him, we would eat him. Put her ass out. Yes, please. No, I'm not feeling it. Why? I don't want to be here. But this movie, I mean, this show is good. I'm tired of praise. I give it to him. Can you please just go to my room, please? He's one of my role models as far as me being a writer, an actress, and a writer. You know, and working on my directing skills. I also have apples in here. I also have apples. We got cranberries. She should know the truth. That Jeez. is not what to tell her. My all-time favorite. Okay, great. You got the better way, Miss. I slept with the president. Oh, don't you dare, Miss Mom of the Year. You should not have told her. Well, it was we crazy because did it. the one chick she left her kid you know, with her sister, with her sister. She's older than I was. To go work with the president. I know you are not trying to justify them talking right now. That's not what well, you, you had no contact with your daughter in no. five years, and then when they find out you're sleeping with the president, you get fired, you get pushed out the, the White House. You end up having to go back home to your daughter and your mother and your sisters. Don't you understand that? Okay. And your daughter is like totally disrespecting you because you ain't been there for five years. You slept with the president, it's all over the news. You guys knew about it, and you left me there. And I was the baby. And she is still a child. Yeah, child, you ain't never been there for. Oh, don't you dare. I have been gone five years. You are here every day. We had a nice day, day today in Detroit. Never it was like 43 degrees. At least I love him. Mom, you don't even know But our weather in Detroit is so crazy. It's like, Please. today will be 43. Tomorrow Shut might be 60. Then stop? it'll drop down to zero. You're like, really? So like, you can go from we shorts to a mink and boots in 24 hours. And you're making it all about you, Shay. I ain't ruined it. I ain't Listen ruined it. Listen to me. You gotta dig down deep, girl. You gotta find it inside of you to get over this. It ain't there. It ain't there. It does Baby, it's there. It's there. Now look. Yeah. Listen, Shay, Blake, I love Sally. On. You have a son and he needs you. I need people too. I know, baby. I know. No, you don't. I mean, we're straight up trailer trash trip. Like this, like this, is what really happens in trailer home, the trailer park, like trailer home areas. But it's pretty good. I like it. It's Tyler Perry's on um the Open Wimpy Network, or you can watch it on TLC Network. If you don't get yourself together, I mean, no, they're on TLC, not the Open Wimpy Network. This show is on TLC. Oh, now that you hurt Matt, it's a TLC show. You hear me? Without TLC movies be the like, either the daddy is yeah, raping the daughter, or the husband is abusive, or the kids are suicidal. <laughs> Somebody doing some witchcraft. <laughs> Everybody having babies. Oh, yes, cheese in my salad, too. I also got salt, pepper, um, parsley, and cilantro. I really like this Italian dressing, but I'm ready to switch flavors now. Yeah, I hope you fall around and die. Yeah, you be I gotta change my shirt because I was getting hot because I'm going to eat this hot and spicy sauce. So I know I'm about to be sweating. All right. My chicken wings. My wing wings. Fried with no flour. Alright, here we go, because I know this sauce has got to be yeah, I got to, uh, this is the sauce that I have in my, <laughs> in my sauce. I got red hot sriracha. And that is super hot, and it's so good by itself. Just chicken by itself. Then, I got my Louisiana chicken wing ding sauce. Then, I also, I also have some buffalo blue cheese. Not to mention, I do have a squig of sweet potato. Can't have this. 
and my flavor hot sauce. All mixed together in one sauce. Alright. Yeah, I got it dipped in the sauce. I heated it up in the microwave for like a couple minutes. So it could all infuse each other. But, okay. I got it dipped in the sauce. I hope it drips on the salad too. Mm. Yeah, super hot. Just the way I like it. On a Saturday, I like simple stuff like salads and seafood or salad and chicken and soup. Plus, I like to cook. And then right now, I got a moment to myself, so it's like, hey, do you? My daughter went to a her daddy daughter dance with her, her dad and her granddad. They'll probably be back soon. Hopefully I'll be able to finish this video before they get here. Top here I got these two brothers. One name is Brody. Oh, and he is fine. With some long blonde hair and tall and ooh. Got some muscles. Then we got another brother named JP. And he crazy. He on drugs. He just crazed out. And their dad is like a doctor. But he got all timers. So he don't remember everything, but he remembers some things about everything. Well, Valentine's Day is approaching. I don't know. My daughter father owns a pool hall here and we had a singles party last night. I didn't go. You. I bet you would be able to expect me to be there, but I wasn't really feeling it. I just wanted to stay home. Um, one of my friends is in the hospital real sick, he fell, and he bumped his head really bad, and it was just bad, so it was like, um, oh, it's a little down because my friend is locked in the hospital. He had his stitches, his head was like this big, he fell downstairs and bumped his head. Okay, I'm out of Italian dressing now, so I guess now. It's like when you eat salad with Italian dressing, it's like, I need a spoon, because it's so... Okay. You gotta eat a salad with a spoon with Italian dressing, because it gets runny. It's like runny. Which ones? I think... Yeah, my shirt says, throw glitter, do not shade the bottom. Uh, it's these two. Uh, I want you to take take all of them. Let's come out of the side. Different. Take all of them. I promise you. Hey, look at me. Look at me. This is gonna make you feel better. You know how you forget. Hey, I found this. 
This salad dressing is creamy um, Caesar. Oh, yeah. Uh, creamy yeah. Caesar. Yeah. And this is a real good big bottle for like a dollar or something. Okay. No, 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 don't. Okay. Oh, he, he was here. Yeah, I know. So, he was in this house, Jesse. Oh, yeah, I found that salad dressing in uh, Save Lot for like a dollar forty nine. Yes. I like, see, this is so good. So, so far, this is like my number one dressing for last year. The I think it's salad. To take no, I, I got a, so I got a closet full of salad dressings like French, yeah. Catalina, Italian, what? Buffalo, Greek, sweet and sour salad dressings. JB. Damn it, Daddy. Stop it now. What? No, hey, JB. Oh, he said this would help my memory. Come on, I'll clean this up. But I, I, I have to mix these. Mixing these will kill you. No, no, JB said they would help my memory. Daddy. What? What? It's okay. Let's go to bed. This boy here trying to kill his daddy. Gonna tell his daddy because he knows his daddy got Alzheimer's. And JB knows his dad got Alzheimer's and Brody with his fire cell. Don't come in there like, uh-uh, daddy. JB trying to kill you. So they will come out with a Fifty Shades of Dark. How did we take? Really How darker can Grey get? <laughs> and end up with something wow. perfectly smooth. Hey, have you guys seen that commercial with Mr. Clean? <laughs> I'm gonna go give you some Mr. Clean <laughs> products. <laughs> we can come dance in my living room every day. Mr. Clean, Mr. Clean. Okay, I'm gonna pass this on these commercials anyway, cause it's already pretty cool. How did we take real fruit? And the commercial's like forever. Mr. Clean, Mr. Clean, gotta see Mr. Clean. <laughs> so make Mr. Clean sexy. Oh, there is. Let me get your butt up on the clean. Mr. Clean is coming to clean. <laughs> Yo, out. Okay. I complicate everything. <sighs> yeah, I'm currently watching everything on my PS4. Everybody's wondering like, what am I playing on? I'm using my PS4 system on um, PlayStation View. Great, it's like I have a cable. I don't even have cable because I don't even need it. All I need is internet. All I need is internet and I can watch anything on my phone, anything on my PlayStation. You name it, I can figure out how to watch it. I watch Days of Our Lives on my cell phone. I watch Days of Our Lives like, back episodes. I'm like six months behind. So I'm watching old episodes on my PlayStation, on the internet. I mean, like, and I was like, oh, girl, you watch TV? Like, yeah, I watch TV, but it's not regular TV. I watch internet TV. It was like so much stuff to watch. You can watch everything at one time. So I have to pre record Don't everything. You know uh, that I never meant to steal. We should look it up later. Take Brody from you. And it gives me something to do on Sundays, like if I don't go to church, I haven't been to church in a minute, so but it like gives me something to do. Like no, I'm staying in the house tonight and catch up on TV. I'm reminding of you. He loves you. And you love him. I know you do. I miss what we had. I miss what we could have. He's just too nice for better to tell me. No, you just, um, you have to press him. I was about to say, you will see. See, watching this yeah. TLC, Too Close to Home, yeah. show. I know what he wants. It's weird because I grew up <clears throat> as the only African-American female, well, Af African-American in my area. <laughs> I grew up in a small town in Monroe, Connecticut. Me too. Maybe about a couple mm -hmm. thousand people. One yeah, yeah. We had one. We had two elementary schools, one middle school, and one high school. Um, everybody knew everybody. Everybody knew everybody lived there. Everybody knew how many people was in your house. And I need you to help me clean up so, first. Yeah, you hear me talking about this white boy Brody in yeah. here? Yeah. And he is fine. Yeah, and I was like, oh, he is fine. 
You got the long blonde hair. Built like an Amazon. I know you must be America's newest male top model or something. Because the top girl, you picked a good one. I got a crush. We got some fine characters. We got some fine actors. Some beautiful ladies, too. But a couple of them are gay. They, they look good, too. Crazy. Um... Well, was, anyway, I, was saying, I grew up in an all-white community as only African-American family, me and my grandmother. Um, so I'm by far, far from prejudice, and I would date outside my race just like that. Mostly got some qualities and skills and, you know, it's okay with your family to be dating me. Look, I thought you'd be more excited to see me. Give me a second. Okay, now you got another couple. This is the black family just, that lives in the, in the um. Just they got this one black second. couple. All right, I, this girl, she lives, her brother lives with her sister. She's in the army, and he's married. I know, I, I get it. I don't want to upset you, okay? And he's married, and the girl, be his thing. wife is cheating on him with the Can other black girl, with his boy. Just that lives on the other side of the trailer park home. A moment, okay, to just press this that you're here. Where, where, where are you going? I need to go take a shower. But you already did. I'll be back. Mm -hmm. So now her husband, now, I got to think of it. I don't know their names all the way yet because they're new to this season. She got her little friends down here from Washington, D.C. Hi. They were trying to chase her, her uh, friends back. Her friends went down there. I'm sorry about earlier. Now well, they stuck down there and, um, uh, to say I to swear you. they are. Listen, I'm sorry. Now I gotta forget this little, this little itty bitty town they're in. So you guys are leaving me there, right? I'm just not sure if Victor's well enough to leave just yet. No, so it's Victor, Victor and Dex. I'm sorry. They're a couple. Like they're it. supposed to be Is a gay couple. They're guys. Yeah. Daddy's in there asleep. Can you keep an eye on him? Yeah, sure. Sheila will keep an eye on him. They got down there. This little town. They don't like gay guys. So Victor gets jumped at the bar because he's drunk and starts flirting with these guys down here. In this little town of Duran. The town will come to me in a minute. Um. Okay, come on. What? We have some making up to do with him. I'm not doing that. So then why did you come here, Dex? Give me more letters. I have my reasons. Come on. You first. Okay, so fine. Put this I'll go up there and talk to him first, and then you're going to go ask more letters. Do you understand? Yeah. Whatever. Good. I'll be right back. Sometimes I don't care if I run out of lettuce because then I'm like, I like to enjoy the rest of the vegetables like the apples and the tomatoes and the grapes and the, and the um, yes. craisins and the pineapple yeah. good. with the no. sauce and the cheese. Not good. So okay, like, what do you know, want? I don't want a friendly cinnamon. That's easy. No. You don't understand. I want it dead tonight. Careful. Oh, yeah. Using your fangs. Ooh. Sharpen my lips. I need a bathing suit on next. I'm sweating from this sun. I'm burning this off so bad. But I want it spicy, so I got it. I got what I, I made what I asked for. I don't need long. We will do a sit down where there will be more fireworks in America than on the 4th of July. What are you going to do? Oh, just watch. He won't leave this horror alone. We just watch. Well, don't forget about our deal. Have I ever? So, the president messed around with. The girl Annabelle. They went there. That's where she And is. the wife found out. Fantastic. The president's wife now found out she messed around with Annabelle. Well, I get my information. When I and now they now wife, Annabelle all left and went back to her little town. Time. And the president still calling Annabelle. Annabelle's trying to get tell him leave her alone. I don't think this is a good idea. The wife trying care. to set something up. Okay, well can you at least just sit down for a minute, Richard? No. Please just sit down for a second, okay? Dax is downstairs. Does it look like I care about her? 
Yes, you do. Okay, so stop. Victor is fine. He's gay. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Like a little, like a little Mexican. It doesn't matter. Well, he is Mexican. <laughs> Look, you should go. And so he should be. I mean, you should at least talk to him. Maybe he can help. My parents? They're fine. They're in immigration. I'm getting so full. I'm going to slow down my country. Wait, what do you mean? Yeah. Okay, well, how did you do that? My salad is so good. Actually. Please just talk to him. I just got I'm to come back. I'm glad that Chester hang up to you guys today. I don't today. care. Yeah, you do. Oh, you guys have spent so many it. years together. Oh, that's before he went up to my family. And then Any upcoming events that I know about as far as Detroit? Okay. Not the moment. Well, my son's having his annual record release party on Hi. Saturday, February 25th for his Hi. birthday party. Um, Thank you. February 25th. Also, my friend, cool. who Luscious, Thomas Crowley, who Luscious you know Promotions. He's a male dancer in a, um, in Atlanta. And he's having a birthday party, too, on Saturday, February 25th. So, like, how can I be at two parties at one time? Because my son's party and my friend's party in Atlanta are the same day. It's like, okay. Yeah, you can't be in Detroit and Atlanta at the same time. Well, you really want to be in Atlanta, but I don't want to disappoint my son. Don't be in his party. This time here. But I've been with you for 23 years. I really I want to go that. out. I need to go on vacation. I need a vacation. I love her live with me. Because oh, we got the girl here from um, the other Tyler Perry show. She didn't pay the rent. He sends her all of his money. Just, I, just, I just don't know what he sees in her. Through time, he will find out his wife is cheating. Well, I get married, I'm cheating on my husband. If I cheat on my husband, best believe he did. He's not doing something right. I think I'll get a divorce first. Matter of fact, and that's like, why do people get married and then when you get married, everything is all good? And then you turn around and just cheat on each other, like, oh, hey, we was turning up for a couple of months, about a good year, we was running real good. Then I was like, you're tired of each other. You're and arguing you're every day. You you're cheating on each other. It doesn't make any her. sense. Not by ruining my brother's life. It's not gonna ruin his life. How are you be with somebody for so long to get married and to cheat? Brother, we should never got married then. Switch. And our people who believe in the and Bible is like, if you cheat, care. it's like you would have killed both of them. Either you gotta so stick it out. I'm protecting him. Depending on how you how you run your Christianity, you know? It's like sorry, There's so many different things. So many different so much, so much different stuff, so much worldly stuff. It's like, that damn L. like right now I'm not in a relationship, but I know if I'm with somebody and I'm dating, I'm trying to start a relationship okay, or be with you. them, or we got kids, or my daughter's father, they cheated. So I was like, since you're gonna cheat, I shouldn't sit in the house with the kids, like, oh, like I'm in love and you out cheating with this girl, that girl, that girl. So it's just like, okay, fine. Cheating on you with a body like that? Time for me to keep well, it Well, yeah, I'm going to keep my full figure then. <laughs> but they going to just cheat anyway. It seems like it, huh? And then it's like, well, it's just like I said, a motto. You can't, you could. What? You and me too. Every two minutes, we can't live without them. Assaulted. The effects of the best are up there. I'm gonna sleep good tonight because I'm getting so full and I still got a lot left. Where are you going? I'm like, I still got a lot of salad left. That's what was my father said. He said, I still got a lot left. Yeah. I gave you everything you still have, bitch. I still got a lot of chicken wings left. Yeah. Price tag on it. So I usually nibble. So watching this show is like almost an hour long. So it's like, I'll eat half of this and then, like, okay, I'll eat it later. Because I've been, um. I I'm running my business them. today because I have a, uh, my own Kyle business. Kevin, <laughs> I have a personal Jackson, service. So I had a client who needed um, the living room and kitchen clean today. So I had to, because um, they're having a date. So I had to um, do my little personal, sort of personal okay. service and put on my, so <laughs> as Jocelyn Hernandez would say, my Molly the Maid <laughs> outfit and go clean today. <laughs> I love Jocelyn. She's so funny. She's a Scorpio, just like me. Yeah. Turn that. That's why, like, people are like, "Oh, you were so crazy." And tell me, like, "You act crazy. You act crazy." And I'm like, "How? You act like Jocelyn." I'm like, "How do I act like Jocelyn?" And you know what I'm saying? Everything. So like, how do I act like Jocelyn? Right. And I found that she's a Scorpio. I'm like, oh, I'm not wanting to her. 
CBJ, me, all of us got our birthdays in the same week. Oh, not to mention, I'm not going to leave out my boo-boo, Ronnie DeVoe, November 12th, yes, he's a Scorpio too. Scorpios rule, Jerogue, Ro James, Nelly, doesn't okay. name a few, doesn't okay. name a few artists. I was saying, so, hey, that would make sense. The man I'm standing in front of would know the difference between immigration and this country. Yes, yes, please, turn them around. Hold on just a second. I think the illegal's upset. You, Dex. Yes, he is. So, Dex, so... Dex just, Dex and, and Victor, like I said, are boyfriend, so boyfriend and boyfriend. So since Dex, so since Dex, so Victor doesn't want to talk back to Dex, and I guess Dex was cheating or whatever, or got caught cheating or calling somebody else on the phone. So Dex gonna call immigration and have him sent back to Mexico because he don't want to mess. With, he don't want to be back with him. Mm. Uh oh. Uh-oh. You know why uh, Tina and Regina don't like you, right? So Regina... I mean, I don't care. And Tina. Regina you is... You want, me? you want me? As much as I want an STD. That's cold. Goodbye, go back to your damn house. <laughs> Okay, now this the other black guy. This the guy that's married to the other lady. I'm trying to figure this out. Now he's sleeping with his boy's wife. So now he's coming over next door to try to talk to the other lady. On the other side of her. You know that. You need to get off my damn porch. I saw you talking to Tavia. Who's that about? Maybe you should. I'm trying to get all the black people together. I know all the white, I don't know all the um, white people put in here, but maybe that's something you need to ask yourself. So Octavia, take a responsibility. That's a, it's Tina, a good thing. it's Octavia, okay. Tina, Regina. Yeah, especially when it's involving all the folks around here in their lives. I don't know what her name well, is. The other guy's name is, life. and the guy from the army just came it. home. Now the guy from the army you need to get off my damn porch. Is married to Regina, and I know what you Octavia brother is from the army and Octavia's brother is married to Regina and Tina is a lady who lives next door which is married to Regina's um Regina I mean Octavia's brother's friend and Regina is sleeping with woman's husband with real crazy got a real hot temper yeah and he and his boy sleeping with them oh wow this is big man interesting let me get my popcorn <laughs> you shouldn't be sleeping with that woman. You know nothing about it. And I know you have a wife. And she's clueless. Well, what you gonna tell her to? Did you come here to threaten me? Well, because that's not wise. That's not wise. I assure you, that's not a wise thing to do. Why you gotta be so mean? Because I'm a motherfucker when I'm crossed. Man, what is her name in this show? Your sister has been looking for you for your whole life. <laughs> 46 years is a long Yeah, that fast forward this commercial. Mm. We're all the same anyway. That's what I must have done. Okay. What do you Here comes Brody. Don't do this. You need to leave her alone. You understand me? Well, I'm going to go back have. to... Listen, I don't want... I already have. Listen, I don't want to have to come down here because something happened to you. <laughs> to me? Yeah. You know him. And you know me, Bobo. I don't take things laying down. Just his wife. Why don't you and try to fight your homeboy you over his wife and you married? I'm sorry. Y'all well, supposed to be homeboys. Okay? Know that I know, and I'm watching. All right, and don't you dare go over to Frankie's again. You hear me? Yeah. Frankie. What's name, Frankie? Scene, man. What's going on? The other show. Fine, man. Good. So Frankie I'm is the back. one that came from the other toilet paper show. Yeah, she said yeah, it herself. I see, I see that. Well, hold on. I'm out, man. Is that so? Yeah, you and me both are civilians now. <laughs> so what's up with Frankie here? Really? Yeah. Hey, we gotta go into town and get a beer lit. 
They cussing on here and stuff. Right. That's locking it out. Next time. I'm to watch oh. the original. Okay, well, we gotta catch up. Yeah. <laughs> Just yeah. like old times, man. <laughs> Just like old times. I need more okay. well, good scene, man. Yeah. Catch up with y'all later. I just need to talk to him. I'm gonna head back to the bar now. Get everything fixed up there? Yeah, I did. Yeah? Well, you should let me come up there with you. I wanna help out. Wow. You I sure? swear, I can't eat anymore. Yeah. The gym is acting funny, man. I gotta, I gotta get away. Oh. Let's go. Okay. Yeah? Yeah. Come on. Oh, this spicy stuff got me sweating. Look at my forehead. It's not a sweat. Girl's coming out. I'm sweating my hair. It's curling up. Now the sheriff pulling up. Why is the sheriff pulling up? Oh, that's right, because they want their mama house to get cleaned out because her mama house, she was sitting up in the house. And they nobody clean the house. Where's Barney? Oh, she's resting. Sheriff, what's going on? Well, you got some trustees on the way over. Right now? Yeah. No, no, I... I that's not what's up, man. I'm going to stop drinking. Sheriff, I haven't even talked to you. I've been drinking this pop for years. I used to live in South West Detroit. What's South West Detroit is like predominantly Mexican. No, I'm not Mexican. At least I don't know. I'm still trying to learn. I'm still trying to figure out my maternal side of the family. So I don't know too much about my mom's side of the family, but from what she's telling me. Mm. That's another story. Maybe I'll talk about that another day. Okay, this is about to go off. I'm pretty much through eating. Um, hope everybody have a wonderful and safe Valentine's weekend. Um, no, you didn't. If I can get up from here, Shelby, I swear to God, I'll break your starting little neck right now. This the mama. The mama's like, the mama's like this big, and she's stuck in the bed. She can't get out. And the police and her trailer is like so funky, and everything is like everywhere, and she just won't get out of her bed. And she don't know that the police is there to come clean her house out. Oh. There ain't nothing wrong with this place. I went shopping today. I got a few things. Stuff. These I got this my daughter today. No, 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 no. She's a woman. I got a phone in there. You know what? That's it, Mama. I got this it. one for no, her. It blows away. I got me you one too, but it's white. Where are you going to go, Mama? They were, um, Mama? At Dollar General. They had a sale. Said... For like, uh oh. They had a sale. No, Mama, it was like ten dollars, but it was twenty five percent off. So I got her one. She gonna be so happy because she saw mine the other day. I was like, no, it's not for you. She straight thought it was for her. Like every bag I bring in the house, you always have to think it's for you. She's like fifteen, about to be um, sixteen. I got three kids. All the birthdays were born. I got four kids, but like I said, my oldest son, his birthday is on the twenty fifth. I mean, on twenty fourth, but his party is on twenty fifth. Uh, and my other three kids, all the birthdays is June fourth. My daughter's birthday is born. It's the same day as Prince's birthday. Rest in peace, Prince. On June seventh, and then my other daughter, her birthday is June twenty seventh. So. No, no, I got two Gemini's, I got a Pisces, two Gemini's, and a Cancer. I'm not kidding, I gotta be able to see everything you're doing. You can, you can sit right here and watch us do it. We'll, we'll, we'll take care of it. Oh, wow. All right. I'm nice and full. I'm ready right to start my evening. I'm about to go make some jello shots. Hey, you trying to do Just in case I go out tonight yeah, because yeah, I sell them for a dollar a shot. I bought some gummy bears, so I think I'll put some gummy bears in a couple of the jello shots just to see how I can sell them. See if I do a, no, see how uh, how much of a profit I can make with the jello, um, the gummy bear inside the jello shots. Because a few people have been asking, like, oh, you do the jello, the, um, the gummy bear jello shots? I'm like, no. But I can. So today, I was in a Dollar Tree. I got a couple bags of um, gummy bears. So. I'm going to use my effing vodka. I don't know where my effing vodka is. Effing vodka about 50 cents. Check it out. 
If you haven't tried it, oh my God, try it. You think Hennessy and Patron and the Jose Quavo and the other big notch. That Evan Vodka. I put that neck to neck because I like Hennessy and I like Vodka. So now Evan Vodka is now my new Vodka. For real, because it gets, it gets you there. It gets you there just like Hennessy gets you there. Mm -hmm. So tell your boyfriend, you better get some condoms. <laughs> no, I'm just playing. It's so silly. You yeah, have pop it out. Baby, have some babies. Ain't nothing wrong with me. Well, she's going to help us. I ain't got nothing wrong with me. I don't need no help. Well, you don't have much choice. Oh, my food was so good and I'm so full. I don't want to finish my chicken wings. I guess not. I'm here to talk with you. I'm just glad I got this moment to hang out for a minute. No children, no kids. Because I know soon my daughter, her father, will be back from the daddy. Because he'll be dropping her off soon from the daddy daughter dance. So I'm glad at least got a chance to do one eating show today. I wanted to do two, but I said I cannot I even finish this. I was going to do um, Tyler Perry's other show, my other favorite show, The Have and the Have Nots. If you haven't caught up in that, catch up on it. I think we're like a season four now. Have it, so it's a have it, have not. Too close for home. I'm waiting for the other one to come out, back out. My other favorite one by Tyler. My memory must be getting short because the phone keeps stopping. Um, shout out to all of our um, 420 people. You know what 420 is, you know what 420 is. If you're wearing a D, we know what 420 is. <laughs> Bonnie, she's the youngest sister. She is so crazy. I mean, not Bonnie, Shelby. Shelby's the youngest sister. Yeah, we already know that. What's wrong with her, Frankie? Remember, there's major issues you have lost. Okay, look at my lashes. My photographer was like, go get these lashes. I'm like, look, these lashes so long. <laughs> But hey, she can't clean up. She can't that's what the photographer wants. You gotta do what the photographer wants. You gotta give him what he wants. Sure. If you want long lashes, I gotta have long lashes. I need blonde hair, I gotta have blonde hair. I need red hair, I gotta have red hair. You want leggings and heels, leggings and heels. Bright lipstick, everything. Big earrings, crazy. But it's fun, I have fun. It's so much fun when I, um, when I model and taking pictures because I could be somebody else. You know what I'm saying? I feel like I get a freedom when I'm in front of that camera. Like when I'm on stage, like when I'm at rehearsal, when I'm going to do the plays, when I'm going to do the short films. And anything entertainment, like if I even go to a, um, an adult party, it's like, hey, there's peaches. I could be peaches. I could be myself. I don't have to be the person I am at home, which I just, I like to, when it comes to entertainment, it's like, yeah. I, it's like I'm here. Like, what's that? We want easy, you know. <laughs> we come to see peaches. But I mean, I just, it's, you know, it is what it is. It's tiring. It's tiring. I'm like right now, I'm tired because I do have to run around with my kids. I gotta take care of my own business. I gotta run a business. Then I got, you know, then I still have to make money, so I have to do little side shows like modeling and different plays and stuff like that, whatever, different gigs. So it's a constant, it's a constant thing. Um, hopefully, by the end of this year, my, my after career, because I did put it on pause for a little while, now that my daughter's about, she's going to be five now. So I figured it's time for me to get back and to what I was doing. Um, I got a few short, I got a short uh, movie out. I got a short film out called Untold Pressures. It's also on my YouTube page. Um, that's only part one. It's like two part, it's a three part short film. Also working on another project called The Gigalettes. It's about these three chicks. Um, it owned us this um, underground after hour um, slash, you know what I'm saying, underground, some underground stuff. And um, so that's what I'm currently working on. I figured um, I'd do a little rap, a little rap single, 
Yeah, I have flows. I could flow a little bit, you know. I'll give you a little bit one day when I'm like really, free. maybe when I, when I come out here and I'm eating and I'm doing, and I'm on my Hennessy kind of just feel like food or just come out here one day. Not just doing an eating show, just maybe something, I don't know, because I'm really just trying to get off of my show, you know, Missy Beck Goes Loca. Um, so I'm making this, you know, part of it. So either if I'm out and about, like the other day we went to see Elmo with my daughter's um, head start class. Um, you know, so everywhere I go, I'm going to film something. I'm going to put something out there because I was listening to Tyler Perry one day. I was listening to a lot of these, these, um, these directors, these writers, these entertainers, these people. And it's like here in Detroit, it's like, there's so many people hating on each other. It's like, they don't want to, nobody wants to see you get ahead or, you know what I'm saying? If it's not, in it, if they're not in it to win it, then they can't have your back. Like, you know, okay. People been know I want to do my own talk show. I want to do this. I want to do that. I want to do that. But I, you can't sit around and wait for somebody to do it. You have to do it. If you can't do it, if somebody can't help you, you got to get out and help yourself. You got to get out and put yourself out there. If nobody wants to help you do it, do it yourself. If you got the talent, you got the skills, you know how to work the camera, you know how to direct yourself, you know how to edit, cut, film. By all means, get up and do your own talk show. Get up and do your own TV show. Get up and do your own, um, you know, review stands or whatever. Or whatever it is you got to do to put yourself out here because you only live once life is short stop sitting around waiting on somebody because I've learned I've learned that the hard way stop waiting wait 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 no work 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 wait 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 oh I'm gonna help you I'm gonna help you oh I promise this or let's do this let's do that and I always say okay I'm like okay all right people I got a call coming in. <laughs> All right, I love you. This your girl, Miss Yvette, goes local, live in front from the Detroit city. Hey, the Motown players. Till next time, peace.